The Star Wars Life Day Treasury is the third anthology released in the kind of myths and fables line of books. Written by George Mann and Kevin Scott, it's a collection of eight holiday-themed stories set in the Star Wars universe. Although it looks like myths and fables and dark legends, I don't get the sense that these short tales are meant to be in-universe legends. Not that that really matters, whether or not these stories are canon isn't important. They're simply meant to take the spirit of our real-world holidays and express those feelings through a Star Wars lens. And this book succeeds in doing so. I'm big into canon and the history of Star Wars, and I love learning new things about about the universe, all that's fun. But it can be easy to forget George Lucas didn't make Star Wars to form some fully fleshed out galaxy. He wanted to say something and tell a story that moved his audience. That's the goal of these eight stories as well, and I was surprised by how much they moved me. I think they all gave me chills at some point or another. Sure, it's got a leg up by pulling at our holiday heartstrings, but whatever, these stories work. They made me feel all the emotions you tend to feel around that time of the year. Happy, grateful, uplifted, sometimes a little bittersweet and melancholy, but never without hope. I think the best word I could use to describe all of them together is comforting. The stories are fast, straightforward, and even predictable, but they all just made me feel good. It's like written comfort food. While the book is called The Life Day Treasury, each story focuses on a different holiday within Star Wars. Some are obviously inspired by Christmas, but not all of them. I noticed similarities with other real-world celebrations as well. Of course, there are also plenty of connections to existing Star Wars stories. The Ewok tale feels like it could have been lifted straight from the 80s cartoon. The Wookiee story is basically a sequel to the original holiday special. There's a High Republic tale, a meet cute on Jetta, and a story about a ceasefire between friends on opposite sides of the Galactic Civil War. And like myths and fables and dark legends, each story is accompanied by some really fantastic looking art by Grant Griffin. I don't think this book will be for everyone. If you're looking for the next big galactic event in Star Wars history, that's not what these stories are about. But if you're a Star Wars fan who really loves the holiday season and what it represents, I think you'll love this collection. I could see a family of Star Wars fans reading some of these together during Christmas or something. Not to mention it also looks really nice out on display. I think Molly will enjoy having it out as decoration this year. But that's what I thought. I was surprised by how moving each story was and how well George Mann, Kevin Scott, and Grant Griffin were able to capture the spirit of the holidays in Star Wars. It's a comforting book, which feels good during these very stressful past couple of years. Let me know what you think of the Life Day Treasury in the comments. If you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, and consider checking out our Patreon page. As always, thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.